texted me and he said, hey man, I uh, met this girl named Chelsea over here and I really want you to meet her. And the first thing I thought is, this is a big step in our friendship. Like he's looking, he's looking for the roommate stamp of approval here. Like things are going pretty fast. I don't know. Kev, I can't believe today is our big day. The day we finally become husband and wife. Well, I cannot wait to tear up the dance floor with you and all of our closest friends. I'm more excited for what's to come after today. I'm excited for the mundane moments that mean the world to me. Walking fish to our favorite coffee shops in Fairmount, making breakfast together with the record player blasting, and picnics along the Schuylkill. I'm truly in awe of who we are today and who you've helped me become. Chelsea, you and I have been engaged for a year and a half, but I feel like I've been waiting for this day with you since I met you. I'll never forget thinking after we met, I didn't know someone like this could exist. We got to spend, uh, during COVID, 120 days straight with Kevin at our house. We really got to know Kevin extremely well. It was a once in a lifetime opportunity. And I have to tell you that he is the most considerate, gentlemanly, easygoing guy in the world. I love him to death and we are so happy to have him now as a son-in-law. <laughs> It's just a perfect match for Chelsea, and, I, and I, I truly mean that. <laughs> okay, you're gonna mess up my makeup. You feel better than I ever could have imagined. Yeah, <laughs> you. Perfect. If you have everything I could ever want in a partner, you are unapologetically yourself. <laughs> when I'm with you, I can be 100% genuine because I know it'll be equally reciprocated by you. We push each other out of our comfort zones and expect the best out of each other. More than anything, I can't wait to see what the rest of our lives together has to offer. I know it'll be filled with a ton of laughs, love, witty puns, and adventure. You have made me the best version of myself, not just by encouraging me to reach beyond my goals, but pushing me to stay true to who I am. Even in our toughest moments, you choose to see the light, and it's the thing I admire the most about you. I'm so lucky to have you in my life, and I can't wait to see how we continue to grow together into the people we were always meant to be. I'm Chelsea's godfather, and I have stories on everybody in the Gourmet family. Chelsea? I have no stories. Anybody who spent more than 20 minutes with Chelsea realizes she's perfect. I thought I've gotten to know Kevin very well, but I have no stories on Kevin either. He's, he's perfect. But this is the weekend, Kevin. I'm gonna check with all your buddies and I'm gonna get the stories. And believe me, I will, because I'm the godfather. Two professionals starting their careers, the perfect girl, meets the perfect guy. And they're perfectly suited to each other. They love each other perfectly. They have a great relationship. They're gonna have a wonderful marriage. By the power vested in me, I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss the bride. <laughs> Thank you.
back to the Kevin and Chelsea love story here. So, you know, people use the term third wheel as kind of like a negative connotation, but I always truly enjoyed being their third wheel. And a lot of my best memories of Kansas City are us three hanging out together. And, you know, it quickly turned from me hanging out with my best friend and his girlfriend to just me hanging out with two of my best friends. How lucky are we? One best friend turned into two. As our relationship grew, I really got into understanding why I liked Kevin so much. We appreciate what it means to be loved by Chelsea and have someone by our side always pushing us to be better. Kevin, we share her with you, knowing that you'll love her for the rest of your life as we have the last 25 years. Chelsea and Kevin, the best is yet to come. We love you. Change coming up, cloud over my head like I'm brainstorming up. Uh, we don't talk too much, so when we say something, uh, everybody they stuck with their face covered up. Uh, but their ears wide open to hear it. Ain't no static up in a room, there's no interference. Get a dustpan in a room, I'm bringing the clearance. Put you people quick to assume, but never quicker to move on. Uh, change the status quo. Ooh, all we know was never stand alone. Ooh, old saints up in the catacombs. Ooh, change coming, you know what matters most. This, that, no chit chat. Down on the rip rap, big name, big. Who you know spit that? I came, my aim, big change, get back Something big here now, no one gonna forget that uh. Or they were husband and wife, or they were fiancés Or they were boyfriend and girlfriend They were first best friends So raise a glass and toast to Kevin and Chelsea And to marrying your best friends <laughs>